Bro, there are too many people in football now that have never played a sport in their life ever. Like that, that I guarantee you that dude that at Barca saying that, and whoever's the admin that's tweeting that bullshit off of North or whoever told the admin to tweet that. Yeah. Never never played a sport in their life. There's no way that we're getting like this level of crybaby in sports. This is not this is not a thing. Yo, but especially Lee, no, bro, okay, especially you're, bro, you're that sounds like a fan. That, that sounds like a fan. Me. Um but I, I can't hear you. Sorry. Can y'all hear me? Yeah, we yeah, are okay, you're sorry. Okay. But uh I I don't I don't like that take Lee. And you're kind of giving me the vibe that like Roy Keane and all the Sky Sports, Gary Neville, Gary Neville. Gary Neville. It's true. Guys said, it's like, true. Bro, no, they, they, bro you, you have to learn how to, you lost, bro. It's, no, it's over. You see, England, Next one, try, try better. So England has this culture of like, you can't speak up to the high authorities because it's not class. Like, I'm not with it. Like, if someone is doing something incorrect and someone's doing a bad job at it, if you publicly call it out, that's unprofessional. Like, you have to call it, out I'm, BS. I'm not fam. even... I'm not arguing what? that. I'm not arguing that. I'm not arguing that. Bro, you've played sports your whole life. You definitely got shafted by calls and lost the game because of it. But are, are you yeah. are you writing a letter to the league officials? Are you, are no, you writing but, a Come on, but, bro. But, but it's, it's good to put on the spot, too. And there's a lot at stake as well, right? Because there has not been any accountability for VAR and referees. Like, they've gotten away with a lot. They do. PGR, they do. You heard. They you just heard make public when, statements. Like, there's why. Nah, no, nah, that's not true. You heard what, what? Needham said. PGMO? I mean, you heard what Needham said. Needham said that they they literally have a monthly meeting yeah. to talk about VAR with all the clubs, and it's an open meeting. Cool, Anybody cool. can join, ask, and no one joins. No, ask, no one. No I, one, I wish, no I wish, one expresses. I wish. No, no, hold on. I wish Mo was here because Anthony Taylor is his biggest friend, and he is the culprit in this big thing, in this controversy as well with the Nottingham Forest game, as well as Stuart Atwell, someone we've mentioned a lot. Like these are names that have been. I'm up many, many times that have affected results and there hasn't been accountability, which I say a lot with a lot of Premier League officials. And it's just, you know, it just kind of goes by and we forget it. Like, bro, like... Generation weak. Yeah, but... Nah, Generation's but, weak, but, man. They're losers. No, Lee, I grow, hear you, grow but, <laughs> but... But same ways, it's like, we don't know it from their perspective. They could have been going to these meetings before and saying, yo, nothing's gone in. Like, nothing's happening. Yeah. Like, what's the point? You guys don't listen to us. The meeting's just <laughs> like a ceremony. You know, you know, MOL. I would have told Nottingham Forest, oh, stop, stop reaching FFP. Maybe you'll get some calls. Cheaters. Uh, <laughs> cheaters. I think, I think, I think the Guilty. pot's calling the pot's calling the kettle something. But uh, I, 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 I never. Been I can't say that last word. Never, never been convicted FFP. Never. But that club's a cheating though. Cheat club. I don't hear nothing though. Where's the outrage? Wait. Wait, you guys know their owner's like a mafia boss. Like say word. Don't play. Oh, no, 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 no. Ace, I'll take it. Don't play with owner. him. Their their owner is not Muslim. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> That's uh, all it is. Uh, <laughs> uh, damn. It's, it's, 